Hi, the, the PE guys, guys are back. back. Hey, today we're going to introduce some backyard activities. Well, if you don't have room in your backyard, you can always go to the front yard. So we got a variety of equipment here. Mm -hmm. Mike, you want to introduce some yes. of that? Uh, so the first thing I want to go over is, of course, yard work. We've got to make sure our area is safe and clean. So we brought our blower to clean up our areas, our messy areas. Yeah, and especially out in our area, we got a lot of sticker balls. So we want to blow it clean, get everything ready for game. So it is powerful. Definitely don't want to step on sticker balls. They hurt a lot. Um, once the area is clean, uh, we have a bunch of different activities you can do. It really is also dependent on what items you have, but we have ways of kind of supplementing it if you don't have the correct items. So, uh, first ones I'm going to go over are tennis. So we have our rackets here if you want to play tennis. Um, we also have tennis balls. Now, if you happen to not have a racket, but you have a tennis ball or a ball, you can actually use your hand instead yes. if you prefer. That works out really good. Then we got a variety of balls that are you're used to seeing. We got basketball, we got soccer ball, volleyball, volleyball. football, and uh, we got some frisbees over here. Um, we got wiffle ball back because it's safe. Uh, we got golf club, but that's only for people who are authorized to use it. Uh, baseball gloves, bats. We got a works. Oh, by the way, also got fruit. If you don't have a ball laying around, you can always play catch with a piece of fruit. Mm -hmm. You got a lemon, you got an orange, you got an apple. The great thing about it, after you're done throwing it around, playing with it, you can eat it. Yeah. And it's very healthy yeah. as well. Yeah, you get nutrition while exercising, so it's mm -hmm. awesome. Just mm -hmm. make sure you wash your apples after playing with them. Oh, mine's clean.